Hello everyone and welcome to yet another video of Mediocre Splatoon 2. I know it's been a while since I posted and I know that a lot of things have happened to Splatfest, etc. And this is a pretty old video. I think I recorded it in November and this is just a voiceover but I'm a college student and I have other responsibilities. Sorry about that. So. We'll just uh, do a voiceover over this old video and see what happens. Um, so yes, as you can see, I'm playing Splat Zone. I don't remember what rank I was at this time. I guess I was A. I've fallen down to an A- since then. So these were the good times. Um, but yes, you can see another inkjet, which I used to be confident that I could beat it, but okay. and. Obviously, I was very cornered over there. And we're all dying. Yes, this is not good. I am obviously quite bad at this game, even though this is one of my better stages. They're all the way here. I feel that we should challenge these people. And it worked. I like getting my baller in spot zones because I can infiltrate the opponent's area. And this seems like a good opportunity to regain control. Maybe, as you can see, I'm trying to um, go into their area near the spawn. I'm not sure if that was a good idea. Um, I actually don't know why I'm doing this. I'm going to die soon, probably. Um, let's see. Well, I mean, at least I got one person. That helps. And yes, my I ran out of ink, but at least we, you know, we got the lead, so I'm quite happy about that. Let's see if I die from the inkjet. I did not. Wow. Wow, and I even got the slosher. That's, um, unexpected. I should probably not allow these two people to die. Um, I did okay, and I still didn't die. Wow. I mean, my ability to avoid dying is pretty nice. And we won the game. That was pretty surprising considering how badly I did in the beginning. But yes, that was good. Oh, now we can see what rank I was at this time. Let's see. Hmm. Oh, I was A minus. So I was A minus, went up to A, and fell back down to an A minus. Today, actually, I fell down. Um, my rank fell today. But at least um, I improved. A bit. And so another video of Splat Zones. Let's see how I did this time. I'm pretty sure that overall in this video I won twice and lost twice. Uh, spoiler alert, but um, let's see which one this was. Lots of booyahs going around. Um, I'm not dexterous enough to do booyahs while moving around, so sorry if you made some. I'm not I'm not skilled enough to multitask. I think I recorded this video before I started using the Gluga Dually, so at this time I didn't really have a lot of um, experience with ink armor, but now that I have used the Gluga Dually, I feel like I, I appreciate the special a bit more. And so far we're doing well. Maybe this was one of the matches where I won. Um, but we'll see. I see that I was saving my special. Um, I hope that I get to use it before um, dying. I don't know what I was doing there. Oh, there was someone there and I had seen... Yes, I just wasted my special. That's unfortunate. That's unfortunate. Um, I actually don't know how to pronounce his uh, YouTube name. I think it's Etsy. That's how I pronounce it. Oh well, another step there. <laughs> but um, he does say how unfortunate and I really like that phrase. So shout out to you. He's my favorite um, Splatoon YouTuber actually, to be honest. And judging from the progression of this video, I think that I will this will have been one of the um, matches where I lose. But we'll see. I mean, like, at least I managed to get my baller. 
um, but it had, did prove to be very helpful. And the uh, counter, is that what it's called? It's ticking. We're going to lose the lead soon. It's all very bad. Yes, we have lost the lead. Did I think the stage changed after this recording? Like, I think the pillars there were higher. Hmm. I don't really remember. Uh, yeah, because this video is pretty old, so I wouldn't be surprised if it had changed. Well, yes. I suppose that at least my prediction was right that this was one of the matches where I lost. But that is still quite unfortunate. Luckily, I'm over the OK bar. So, another match. Let's um, try the other match. Okay, so Sturgeon Shipyard. I think that these two stages that we've seen in this video um, these are one of my better stages. I really, really don't like Moray's Towers. Those, that is one of my worst stages. And it was kind of funny that they chose that stage in the new Smash game. Uh, which, by the way, I do own um, Smash Ultimate, which, and it's super fun. I'm really enjoying it. Um, and I'm using the inkling quite a bit. My main used to be Kirby, so I might upload a Smash video in the future um, just for a bit of variety and it's um, loosely related to Splatoon, so maybe you'll see a video of that in the future. Um, my New Year resolution, one of them at least, is actually to gain 20 subscribers on this channel, so um, Maybe you can all help me with that goal, and I need to be very proactive in order to achieve that goal. So back to the video. Um, it looks like my teammates are doing pretty well without me. Um, yes, they managed to go all the way down to 26 without me. And... Was this before the patch? It seems like it was easier to get the baller. I don't know if they changed how easy it was to get the baller after the patch. Um, but yes, at least I think that I got the baller quite a lot um, during these matches. And I don't have a great feeling about this match. We'll see whether or not I was wrong. See, I already got my baller again. This is um, pretty quick. And actually, you know, I changed my mind. I had a better feeling about this match. Um, we'll see whether or not I was right. Um, I see someone coming up over there. That was quite conspicuous. Oh, okay. Get out of the rain. The rain, I used to think of it as like one of the new noob specials, but I mean it can get pretty annoying when it's used frequently and used a lot. I don't like this color. Green is not my favorite ink color. But overall this match seems to be going pretty well. More ink armor. Maybe? No. This was before the... Hmm. I think it was before the Gluga Duelies. And I ran away quite a lot. And see, my baller is already there again, so... I don't know. I'm, I'm not the best with all these patches and updates and... And I just ran into a bubble. That was pretty... What? Did it explode because they ran into a bubble? Is that the cause? I don't know. I thought I saw a video. Oh, tends to myself. Um, I thought I saw a video um, by one of the great Splatoon YouTubers about saying 
Oh no, that was about splashdown. I was thinking like, oh, it takes three splashdowns to destroy a baller, but um, the speeds are bubbles, so I guess they may be different. I kind of feel sorry for dying so much, but my teammates are doing well without me. If you do subscribe to this channel, please do. Um, you'll notice that the phrase, my teammates are doing well without me, is um, quite common on this channel. Because as you know, I'm mediocre. I'm true to the title. But I do guess that this was um, the video where we won, which is nice. Unless um, there's a complete turnaround in the uh, last 30 seconds, which in Turf Wars, it's very common for me to do, for my team to do well. Oh, see, there's one, there was one point left. So it's pretty common where um, I, my team does fairly well on the first, um, let's say, two minutes, 30 seconds of the match, and then the last 30 seconds, we like just completely lose it. Not to say that I blame my teammates, in fact, I think they do pretty well considering that I'm on their team. Um, it's just unfortunate, that's all. And wow, we're all really dying. Torpedoes. I'm dying. I have nothing to say. I think if we're unlucky, this match could have a complete... Oh my gosh, we're gonna lose. We had one point left and we're gonna lose. This is, this is absolutely horrible. I, I need to... I, oh wow. That was a complete complete turnaround. That was like, what was it, the UK Championships? I forgot which match, but like one of the matches was like, like, I don't know, like 50 to like, I don't know, 11, and then they completely turned it around, but then they didn't manage to win. Anyway, that was, that was just sad. I remember the match. I remember it around halfway, but I didn't want to spoil it for you. Uh, but yeah, that was sad. Oh well. So I already told you that I won two matches and lost two matches in this overall recording. And actually, I don't know if my memory was correct, so I might be wrong, but hopefully this is the match where I won, in which case that will be a better ending than that disaster in the previous um, clip. So let's see how this goes. If I lose in this match as well, I will be quite disappointed with myself and my memory skills. I think um, the duelies were one of the first um, weapons that I bought. And um, ever since then, you know, you get used to the dodge rolling and it's hard to use other weapons. I also like the end zap and the aerospray for a while, but uh, yeah, I came back to the duelies. The, I mean, the end zap and the aerospray, I feel that for me, they're good for turf wars. But the duelies, I mean, like the dodge rolls, you get addicted to them somewhat. And it's hard to use anything else. So, if you want to be a good Splatoon player, don't start off with the duelies. That would be my advice. Advice from a mediocre Splatoon player. And as I said previously, I'm not um, skilled enough to do Booyah's wall fighting. So um, when someone uses a Booyah bomb, I'm one of the bad people who don't Booyah. And I know that's really bad and I'm not a good teammate, but I mean like, it's probably better than me dying, right? So if you ever see me and I, if I'm ever on your team, let me apologize in advance for not being able to smash that booyah button. And considering how I think I won this game, I mean like, where I'm not doing amazing, I'm dying a lot. My dad, he watches me play um, occasionally and he does note that I die a lot while playing the game. Yeah, I hope that I didn't lose this game. That would be pretty sad. Did I already win two games? Now my memory is just like, I don't know what's going on. 
torpedoes. I haven't seen people use torpedoes recently. Hmm. I don't remember. Maybe they lost popularity or I just haven't been playing it that much, that's also possible. Um and we're gonna lose the lead soon. This is not good. Yeah, I haven't been playing um the game much uh over winter break because it was a time spent with family and the time spent uh playing Smash. Um yes, and we have lost the lead. But uh now I hope to play it more and hopefully be more dedicated in um, uploading videos. Like, if I don't do it over winter break, like, when will I do it, you know? Um, school will just get busier and busier. I mean, really, oh. I, I, ho I was hoping that I wouldn't die again, but I've died yet again. But uh, these two teammates are doing really well. Thank you, teammates, for... Um, making up for my horrible skills. I feel like I should have protected that person. Hmm. Uh, oh, yeah, I, I could have used that opportunity to booyah since I was spawning anyway. Um, one of the few times you'll see me booyahing is when I'm spawning, so soon after I've died. Wow, I just keep dying in this game, don't I? I'm playing horribly. This is not a good way to end this uh, episode, I think, but hopefully, um, hopefully it got better. I mean, like, my teammates are doing a good job of just getting the zone without me. Oh, maybe, um, now that I diagnosed myself, Maybe I was too aggressive, you know. I should have, you know, stayed back a bit, but I was just chasing people. These people. Oh wow, I got two people with that. That was that was pretty good. And the third person, wow, that was and I think that might have redeemed my whole play. And just uh wow, we've taken the lead. Um I think this uh this uh, turnaround makes up for the horrible clip that was just before this. So I think that's a pretty good way to end this episode. And well, uh, thank you everyone for watching. Please help my New Year's resolution by subscribing and please leave a comment. So happy 2019!